Hi, I'm Mitchell Dale. This is RLW TV. I'm joined by Martin Lenahan and Eric Groth. Boys, end of an era at Parramatta. Cult figure, Fooey Fooey Moy Moy. He's been told he's not uh, not needed next year. He's a good mate of yours. What do you think? Yeah, I think uh, the club will have a mutiny on their hands of the, the fans, you know, blowing up about that one. But yeah, you know, all good things come to an end, unfortunately. And mate, there'll be a plethora of uh, clubs, you know, uni universally that Overseas, could use his services. Yeah. Look, I, I, my favourite memory would definitely be uh, back in 09. It was just rampant when uh, when Parramatta got through to the grand final. As you said, the cult figure. Mate, I'd love to see him in Japanese rugby. Wouldn't he be a huge hit over there? He can do TV commercials. Yeah. He'd be a cult figure he over there. He passes a sumo. He looks a bit like a sumo when he puts his hair in, in, in a bun. How do you go in the rugby union rules? Uh, oh. I don't think he'd understand, no, but I don't think no that matters. No one understands him anyway. Mate, it'd be good. Uh, he'd be, he wouldn't fit into you know the little Japanese guy's gear, so he wouldn't be able to steal it, which would be a nice change. Fooey, I'd like my thongs back, mate. <laughs> Very good. Look, yeah, as we said, it is the end of an era there, but uh, I'm sure Fooey will pop up probably in Super League, if not maybe Japanese rugby.